everyone. I'm Mike, a South Florida firefighter, back today with Drone Nerds to take a look at the brand new DJI Mavic 3 thermal drone and some of the specs and features. We're going to take a look at some of the specs and features specifically for first responders, fire, and police. I think firefighters, first responders, and police officers are going to be super excited about this new drone. One being the portability. I know I'm super excited about how compact and portable this drone is. With it weighing just over 900 grams, this drone does not weigh a lot and it's super sturdy and compact. Obviously it comes in this compact case. Speaking of compact, DJI just put the new battery in the back to make it nice and streamlined. One of the biggest new features that I absolutely love is the new 45 minute flight time. This is gonna allow us to fly in those hard to get to areas with the drone being small and get that longer flight time to help complete our mission. So I'm looking forward to that. I know you guys will be looking forward to it and I can't wait to see what this thing does. One of the biggest new features of the Mavic 3 thermal drone is the triple camera system. As you can see, we have three cameras on one gimbal. We have a wide angle camera with 48 megapixel resolution. We have a thermal camera with 640 by 512 resolution. And we have a zoom camera with 12 megapixels and 56 times hybrid zoom. So that packs a big punch on one gimbal. The top of the drone has a quick plug and play for the DJI speaker, which is optional. And what I love about this drone is the new beacon for increased visual line of sight, especially during night operations. Let's take a look at the safety features of the Mavic 3 thermal drone. The first safety feature is the omnidirectional obstacle avoidance. We have sensors on all sides of the drone. So we have that ease and peace of mind when we're trying to complete our mission. Speaking of completing our mission, one of my favorite features on this drone is the APAS 5.0. If we're basically going at an object, the APAS 5.0 kicks in and we can still go around the object to complete the mission. The last safety feature of the Mavic 3 Thermal is the new advanced return to home feature. This drone will now internally plan the best route home to save power, time, and the hassle of knowing your drone is going to get back safe. This thermal camera has 10 different color palettes and I think with all the choices we're going to have a lot to choose from for different scenarios. Day, night, car accidents, fires, hazmat situations, search and rescue. We got a lot of color palettes that are very easy to get to and uh, a lot to choose from. Second is the 56 times hybrid zoom. This hybrid zoom is going to allow us to see stuff a little bit better if we can't get as close as we need to be. This drone is small and compact, which we like, and it usually gets us to where we need, but we now have the ability to see things from further away with the 56 times hybrid zoom, which is almost double its predecessor, the Mavic 2 Enterprise Advanced. So I'm very excited about that, and you should be, and I can't wait to see the features in the field. The DJI Mavic 3 Thermal comes with the RC Pro Enterprise Remote Controller. This has a five and a half inch screen, 1000 nit brightness, and has a three hour battery life. It also recharges in only an hour and a half. These have been some of the specs and features of the brand new DJI Mavic 3 Thermal Drone. With this drone already being light, compact, and portable, paired with 
the triple camera system, and 45 minute flight time, I think police, fire, and first responders are gonna love this drone to add to their arsenal. Feel free to leave a comment below or contact us at experts at dronenerds.com for any further questions. Once again, I'm Mike with Drone Nerds. Have a nice day.